Who is God? And what is sin? Who is Jesus? And who is the devil? What is the place called hell? And what is the place called heaven? What is the Bible? The Word of God. And why does God love you? I can go to heaven. And now I would like to tell you. I would like to tell you about God. God so loved the world. God loves you. But God does not love sin. God despises sin. God hates stealing and killing, fornication, anger, and fighting. God hates sin. He cannot accept it. God in heaven has joy and gladness, but here on earth, in the world, there is much sin. But God still loves you. God in heaven sent Jesus, his son, because he loved the world. God sent Jesus to come into the world to be crucified. Jesus willingly came to the world. Jesus was born as a babe. He grew, and Jesus showed love to all who were in the world. Jesus knew that the world had sin. But still, Jesus called people to himself. Jesus spoke to the people. Jesus warned them about the place called hell and warned about sin, which will lead people to hell. He warned them about rejecting God. Jesus told about God in heaven. But many of the people refused to believe. They refused to listen. Jesus continued to help. Jesus continued to encourage. Jesus continued to call people to himself. But they took Jesus. They beat him. They whipped him. He suffered much. They took him and led him away to the cross to be crucified. And there on the cross, Jesus looked at the people with their sins. And Jesus still loved the world. Jesus died on the cross. The devil surely rejoiced. The devil does not love you. The devil would love to take you and cast you into the place called hell. But God does love you. And Jesus, who died for you, loves you. He died, he was buried, and three days later he rose from the grave alive again. Jesus took away sins. He defeated the devil. And Jesus now invites all to come and be saved. He invites people to have life in their hearts so that they pray to God and accept Him and have the love of God in their hearts. Sin cannot go to heaven. Heaven is a wonderful, beautiful place filled with happiness and love and joy and fellowship. There in heaven, 
is no sin. There in heaven, there's no stealing. There in heaven, there's no fighting. There in heaven, there's no drinking of alcohol, but only joy and happiness. There in heaven is eternal life with God, and God does love you. Now listen, you do need to ask God to forgive you. You do need to pray and ask Jesus to forgive you of your sins, of your wrong, so that you will not go to the place of hell, so that you will not suffer and cry and be tormented and punished in the fire, so that you will not die and find yourself in torments in the place called hell. There in hell, there's no cold water to drink. There in hell, there's no hospital. There in hell, people will stay forever, screaming out in their torment forever and ever. Why? Because of sin, because of rejecting God, because of rejecting Jesus Christ and not inviting him into their hearts. Hell is a place of punishment in fire. Why? Because of the filth of sin, because of the wrong which cannot go to heaven, because God will not accept sin into heaven. Why? Because Jesus loves you, and Jesus was crucified, and Jesus offers salvation. He offers you to invite him into your heart. You can ask Jesus to come into your heart. You can ask him to take your sins away, to give you a new heart so that you will have a life of joy and happiness and know that you will not go to hell, but know that you have believed in God, that you've accepted Jesus, and when you die, you will go to heaven. You will be happy that you decided to accept Jesus and to go to heaven forever. Now, which will you choose? Will you choose to hold on to your sin? The Bible says that all people have sinned. The world has sin, and there is a true place called hell. But there is God in heaven, and you can pray. Would you copy with me? Copy these words. I will help you to pray to the Lord Jesus. Let's pray now. Dear Lord Jesus, I know that I have sinned. I have done wrong, and I am sorry. I do not want to go to hell. I do want you to forgive me. Jesus, please come into my heart. I am sorry. Please give me a new heart so I can go to be with you in heaven. I know that you are true, and I believe on you, dear Jesus. Thank you for saving me. Amen.